Hey guys, it's me, your girl Allie, and I am doing a voiceover for this video because the audio quality was not the best, and I decided that doing a voiceover would be much better. In this clip, I'm explaining that I am going to be shopping to get gifts for my friend Mia, whose bridal shower was coming up, and I wanted to take you guys along with me to go get the gifts and to help me make the basket itself. If you hear any dog chewing in the background, it is Ace chewing on a bone. Just a heads up. Just for context, I had gone and found everything I wanted to get from Walmart for this gift, so I basically just had to go and pick everything up and check the prices as I go. Alright, so it looks like I found the baskets, and I picked this basket for Mia's gift. I liked the color, and it was about the same size, or approximate size that I wanted for her gift. Alright, so I already have the blanket in the basket. I chose yellow because Mia's car is yellow and her favorite color varies depending on her day or mood. Um, I was contemplating on getting the black one because that's one of her other favorite favorite colors, but I just stuck with yellow. Alright, I'm going to be completely honest. As I was filming, I did not realize that there was this thing blocking the way on the right side of the camera, so please ignore that. I apologize. As you see, Ace is sniffing these wax melts. Something about it he just fell in love with, but when I opened it, he freaked out. I don't know if it was too much scent or the color, but he did not like it afterwards. So for this gift basket, I got three different kinds. Over the rainbow smelled fabulous. It had all of those different fruits and it smells just beautiful. For the sunlit strawberry patch, it smelled just like strawberries and that's one of Mia's favorite scents. And Honeysuckle Pineapple. This is something both her and I have gotten together at Walmart and I knew she would love this scent. And you know your girl had to get some sugar scrub watermelon. Looks just like the inside of a watermelon. Loving it. I also got her a travel size of lotion. I didn't know if she had any allergies or preferences. When it comes to shower or bath time, who doesn't love a Lisa? I got her purple because we had already gotten her yellow, and that's one of her primary favorite colors is purple. I saw this and I had to get it for her, an iridescent skull mug. She loves skulls, anything Halloween, and anything with the oil spill sheen, and it just looks gorgeous. I love it and I hope she loves it. Like I, I love it so much, like perfect for Halloween, um, around the time of her wedding, hopefully she'll use it on the day of her wedding. Alright, so every self-care kit has to have candy. Anytime Mia and I watch Sam and Colby, we have popcorn, Kit Kats, sour candy, or just chocolate in general. So I got her Sour Patch and two different kinds of Kit Kats that are unique. Alright, so now we're moving on to actually making the basket. I'm going to fast forward this part of the video just so I don't bore you for the next 15 minutes. For the blanket, it was bigger than I thought it was going to be, so I had a very difficult time trying to find the right angles, how to fold the blanket to make sure everything would fit in it how I imagined it. And as you see, I'm folding it, refolding it, adjusting it so many times because I became so frustrated and eventually I just had to do it one way and just stick with it and not being so nitpicky about how I folded the blanket. As you've seen throughout this whole video, Ace is completely and utterly interested in everything I'm doing about this basket. I think it's because of the blanket though. I mean, it is the color yellow, and that is one of the few colors that dogs are able to see. And in this house, we don't really have a lot of yellow things. I mean, not as bright yellow as that. And I think he was thoroughly interested in trying to figure out what this soft yellow thing was. In the meantime, I was trying to keep his black and white fur off of this blanket. And here comes Rosie, interested in it as well. I just think that this is so precious. 
this, I mean Rosie is looking at the basket, then looking at me, trying to figure out what I'm doing. And then I'm telling them to stop because I'm trying to focus and not be frustrated at them when I'm frustrated at trying to make sure everything in this basket will fit. Right, and I have the basket finished. I think it looks gorgeous and I hope Mia really appreciated the gift because to me everything in this basket reminds me of her and the amazing friendship that we have. If you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment of what you think I should be doing in the next video. Anyways, I love you guys. Take care and stay safe.